everyone. So today is Sunday again. So I've been vlogging on a Sunday. But basically, I, I'm taking the kids out today. It's just me and the kids because Graham's actually got a fishing tournament. Um, he's been doing a fish. He done like a previous fishing tournament and got through to the next round. So this is the last round, and he did it last year and he got through. And I think he came second or third. I can't actually remember. But he came home with something. Anyway, he's got this, this fishing tournament um, again this year, and he's gone off already. He went off. He had to get to Winchester for eight o'clock, I think. So he probably left between like half six and seven to get there and so yeah it's basically just me and the kids today so I thought I'd do a vloggy sort of day we're actually I've already pre-booked us to go to Mawa Zoo we haven't been there I want to say in about a year or two um feels like such a long time ago and I feel like they're at the age now where I think they're really gonna love it like I don't know why we didn't go in the summer we probably should have gone but the prices now are so cheap I say so cheap, they're not actually really cheap, they're just cheaper compared to what they're like in like peak season. So, um, which is always good, isn't it? But today's actually supposed to be a kind of partially dry day. I'm going to wrap them up, I'm going to put them in the wellies and we're just going to have a really lovely chill day. They can see all the animals, there's lots of walking, lots of things to do, lots of different little parks and... Um, you know, there's just so much to do. If you've ever been to Marwell, you'll know. But if you haven't, I would highly recommend Marwell. It's a really nice park to go to, like zoo to go to. So that is what we're going to do today. And I thought I'd bring you along. Um, currently, I just made a smoothie. I'm going to have that for breakfast. And I, I want to do my beef and ale pie for tonight. So I've basically pre-cooked my beef and my onion. And then I added the beef and ale gravy stuff that I've got like the packet stuff so I'm going to basically let that cool down and then I'm going to cover it and stick it in the fridge so it's partially done it's like you know what beef's like as long as you fry it off um when I put it in the pie dish when I come home hopefully you won't be home too late when I, when I put it in the pie dish and then top it it probably won't take no more than 15-20 minutes in the oven so that is my plan for tea tonight and then I can just do some steamed veggies on the side Graham will be home a bit later though because this fishing tournament doesn't finish. I think they have the presentation at like half four. So by the time he gets back from Winchester, which could be a good hour, maybe even longer. Yeah, that is the plan for today. It's plan for dinner. I'm just waiting for the kids to come home. I text mother-in-law last night when I booked Marwell and said, can you bring the kids back for half eight? Um, it's 10 past eight now. Because usually she brings them back about nine. It just varies, basically. So I just wanted to make sure they're back so we can go. Because it takes a good hour to get to Marwell. So, yeah, it should be a good day. I've just done packed lunch. I've done some sandwiches. Ham sandwiches, of course. Ham sandwiches. I've got some fruit. I'm probably going to just grab some apples and pears as well. Um, and I've got some, like, dry stuff as well. I'm just going to get myself ready. I need to have a wash. And... Just get dressed really, get wrapped up because it's pretty cold today. I think it's going to be like 10, 11 degrees, which isn't exactly um, that warm, especially if you're going to be out all day. So I really need to wrap myself up. We are off, ready to go. It's just after nine. We had a bit of drama with Willie Boots and Alistair, but I think I need to get him a new pair, to be honest. I think the size oh. he's got is 10 and he's more of 11. So yeah, but they're fine. Um, so yeah, heading off. Where are we going? To the zoo! How about you? You, you, we're going to the zoo. We made it to the wildlife park. He had a good run down the hill. You okay, bye? Bye's being lazy. Lazy bit. It's a well. It was actually really easy to get here. Probably took about 45 minutes, which is a lot quicker than I thought it would be, but there's not really any traffic, so Sunday's quite, you know, quite busy. First stop is the penguins. So they're really cute. <laughs> what do you think? What do you think, bye? They're cute. Hello. Capybara. You see that capybara? Oh. It's like a big guinea pig. <laughs> I think it looks like a big guinea pig. 
They're very cute, aren't they? Yeah, it was like that's what it's called, a capybara. Me a hot chocolate. I put like two of the Tassimo pods in just one of these just to fill it right up. So I've got a nice warm hot chocolate to walk around with. It's actually dry, which is really nice. It's been raining though. On the way here, it was like peeing it down. I thought, oh. But yeah. Yummy snack? Yep. Yeah. Always thinking about their tummies as always. Look at this one. What are you looking for? Yeah, see Savannah tracks. See what we can find. We found an Alistair. <laughs> wow, that's cool. Look so that's that. a water hog. Yeah. Water hog. That's a scrub hare. So it's like a little hare, like a little bunny rabbit. That's a cheetah skull. That's a leopard. And that one is a lion. <gasps> oh, to lions. You want a lion skull? <laughs> teeth. Teeth, yeah, look at their teeth. I Amazing. We spotted a cheetah. What's he eating? He's eating. Is he eating a bird or something? Wow, isn't he? You are super duper tall. Not quite as tall as the giraffe. How about you, Vi? I think you're about 90. Wow. Cracker. Oh, that's cool. It's like the Christmas one. The cracker. Huge. Dead. There's a leopard tail. How, how you can get up that down there? Why well, he can just climb trees. They're inside. They're keeping warm, aren't they? It's nice and warm. <laughs> Cute. Yeah, there's another one coming. There's another one. It's coming. I love the hairdo. My <laughs> <laughs> I flatten it down just a little bit. There we go. Finally. She's so lazy. Aren't you, you cheeky little what's a bit? Why was he on the space thingy? Yeah, well please be careful, Vi. Ooh. A bit wet. We'll go on the climbing frame. Plastic bag and a rain cover so we don't get our bottoms wet, isn't it? Perfect. <laughs> We's quick. Quick, quick, quick. Just snacking on grapes, heading down like down the hill we've kind of come up and now we're going down it's so quiet it's so nice and it's been dry things crossed it stay dry but we're prepared if it rains so yeah so nice it's such a nice day and graham said it's really nice because he's like the other side of winchester doing his fishing so yeah i can't remember what time it is i think it's half 12 but the problem is that i've got is my phone it won't turn on it's completely battered. I should have upgraded and got a new phone, but I decided to just do SIM only. Because I don't really use my phone very often, but yeah, now my phone's just knackered after two and a half years, and I'm like left probably gonna have to buy a new one, I reckon. Baby! <laughs> There's another one. Oh, you're cute. A baby monkey. Yeah. <gasps> that one. He's got an itch. <laughs> He's got an itch. <laughs> it's a cool play area, isn't it? It's very cool. I can't really get up there. No? You want me to help you? Yeah. Okay. Alistair's got my hat on. Or oh, it's Daddy's hat actually, isn't it? Daddy's hat, but I wear it. Oh, yes. Please? Please. Good boy. Good girl. That's it. Good helping. My brother's going to bring it up. That's it. 
Hang on, bye. Watch it come out. Yeah. Ready? It's going to come out here, bye. Look. Hey. See? It's <laughs> our house. Yeah. I think it's the jackdaw. It's the jackdaw. Are you going to go down the slide? It's nice. It's dry. You can go down. You can go down if you like. See your hands. <laughs> Put your hat up, Vi. That's nice. <laughs> Thanks, Vi. Woo, well done. Ready? Well done. Ready? Steady. Look where you're jumping. Go. Yeah, but just do a little jump. Ready? Steady. Bend those knees. Jump. Well done. Is it big jump? Yeah, it was very big. Wow. Sleep. Yeah. Aww. Little tamarind monkeys. What's he eating? He's eating the same. Well, he wants Being, on the maybe a nut. Monkey nut. That's what he's eating. They look so cosy, don't they? Little yeah. lemurs. Yeah. Oh, they're cleaning each other. Really coming to the end. I think we've got hippos, rhinos. I think they've got the reptile or like a rainforest bit, maybe. Um, and then we've got the gift shop, which I don't think we're going to go in because it's just a bit unnecessary, really. And then I think what we're going to do, we're going to go on the train and go around the whole place in, on the train. And that'll probably be the end of our day. We're in a tropical world. Oh, it's hot in here. Lizard! Ah, see. Little dwarf crocodile. Whoa, come on. Where look, at the take look at the ant moving the leaf. I see the, where they're going to take it. Yeah, I think they're probably going to take it to. I don't know. Huge ant hill. There's the hippos. Baby one and mummy one. Cute hippos. Little baby one, isn't there, Vi? So we are home. It's quarter past three. We've been home for about 20 minutes and honestly, we are all so shattered. We've done about four hours of walking, basically. We were there four hours and we just done all the walking. We didn't end up going on the train. The whole time we were there, it didn't even rain. And as soon as we were leaving, that well, basically when we, we thought we were gonna go on the train and then we decided not to, and then it started like pouring down. So we ended up just getting back in the car and heading home. And it was just like the perfect day. I swear, I couldn't even, even ask the kids to be better. They were so well behaved. I think it's because being outside, it's just something they love to do. They were both running around and so interested in all the animals. And I can't believe, actually all the animals we saw because we've been to Marwa before and I've been to Marwa as a child and and usually like the cheetahs and the leopards I never usually get to see them so maybe it's because it's quiet and it's cooler they all come out you know so the kids just loved it and it was just such a good day and actually we went to the gift shop after but they were so good I got them an ice cream because I gave them the choice, I said, you know, would you like hot chocolate or an ice cream? And of course they would have gone for an ice cream. So they had an ice cream, we sat down, they ate that, and then we just basically went home. And I'm just so shattered. I've um, pulled out the beef and ale um, pie mix from the fridge and I've actually stuck it in the oven. I'm gonna let it cook for about, probably an hour and a half on like a, I put it on 150, so quite a sort of medium to high heat. 
and without obviously the pie crust so I want it to cook more slowly so it's not sort of too chewy you know um, so I've done that and I've put some carrots in there and I didn't have any mushrooms which is annoying um, I've just made myself a coffee and a mince pie and I'm literally going to chill out with the kids now I've just put Lego movie on Alistair right at the end just started crying and I was just like what's wrong and he was like my ear and I was like oh no not again not another earache like he hasn't had an earache obviously but Violet's obviously had an earache last week and the week before I mean it went within like a day but still so he's come home after having a nap in the car and I've just done what I did with I gave him some um like child ibuprofen that sort of thing hopefully fingers crossed he'll be well enough to go to school tomorrow but he seems fine now, he seems fine. Um, so yeah, I think we're just gonna chill out. And I've actually had you on charge because I was in the middle of saying that I've heard from Graham, he's actually, he, about an hour, not an hour ago, probably about 40 minutes ago, he messaged me to tell him, to tell me that he was actually in top, like first place currently for like the weight of the fish that they've got. Cause they basically got to catch um, a certain amount of fish um, but big fish and have them weighed and the most weight obviously will be the winner so that's really exciting but it can easily change um, yeah so it's quarter past four I can't believe it's quarter past four I've just been chilling out with kids um, Alice has been watching Lego movie and like building actually I'm going to show you because he's been building a Lego city himself and it's really cool and really clever um. City. This is, Lego. yeah, this is Alistair's Lego City. This is the house. And you've got your helicopter over there. Horses. Rubber, rubber, and policeman got in. Oh, yeah. A girl. <laughs> Love it. Egg and, um, oh, and you've got the digger. Yeah. He's driving on the track. Yeah, you've got two clouds over there. <gasps> What's he doing? He's, he's catching the rubber. Alistair's been being very creative aren't you yeah and building with your lego as always anyway i'm gonna sort out dinner um the stuff's still in the oven Ooh, sounds like she's gonna have a little bit of a meltdown because she's tired um i'm just gonna get veg ready and then put the pie top on top and then steam some of my veg and then feed my tummy because i'm starving we obviously took lunch with us but i took sandwiches and i took fruit and the kids had an ice cream, I didn't have an ice cream. I just bought a cup of tea. So, yeah, feeling hungry? Oh, look at those rosy, beautiful cheeks. You look so tired. Tell everybody what we've been doing today. What have we been doing? Huh? Where did we go? Zoo. Went to the zoo. And what did we see? Animals. Animals, which one was your favorite? Uh -huh. Zebras. The baby zebras. What else did we see? What else did you like? Lions. The lions. I like the lions and the cheetahs. And what's Daddy doing? Going fishing. He's fishing. Do you think he's going to win? Yeah. Yeah. Two fish. Did you get two fish? Yeah, lots. Well, hopefully he get more than two. Hopefully he get like four. I think they've got to get four. You've got hairy hair. I've got hairy hair. Yeah. 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 Yeah, I'm going to get on and peel some potatoes. I think I'm going to do mashed potato um, just because it's easy and quick. Okay, message from Graham. He won. I can't believe it. I'm absolutely amazed and so excited that he's won. I think he came second or third last year and it was just amazing. But I can't believe he actually won it this year. He is gonna be like, his head is not even gonna fit through that door. He's gonna be like, yeah, I've won, I'm the winner. So he's heading home from Winchester. I'm so happy. Um, Cause I know he's gonna be so happy. I'm not massively into fishing like, at all to be honest, but you know, whatever makes him happy. So yeah, dinner's nearly done. I'm doing some, um, just really quick frozen vegetables from Morrison's. They look really nice actually. The, I love the diced carrot in it. Um, I've done some mashed potato and I've topped my pie crust. You can kind of see it nearly browning off. So dinner is nearly done. Hopefully Graham will be home soon. So we're gonna have dinner without him for obvious reasons because we're all starving and I need to get the kids back into routine because it's school tomorrow. 
so yeah i'm just watching a few videos while the kids play and um yeah i'm just gonna serve up dinner i think dinner is ready look how good that pie looks i hope it tastes good um spilets and alistair what is it penguin bath it's a penguin yeah penguin bath penguin bath yeah okay whatever that is very good i think she's gonna stay a lefty aren't you like mummy, you're gonna be left handed like mum. Yeah. yeah? You have big hands. Do I? Yeah. What do you have then? If I have big hands, what do you have? We got little hands. Little hands. That is a very cool trophy, Graham. Daddy. First place. So, what were you last year? Amazing. Beautiful. Daddy, you got a kitten. Well yeah. done, Daddy. What's that then? You won a rod as well? Yeah. Wow. What was your biggest fish? 12 pounds, 7 And what was the one underneath for second place? 10 pounds. Whoa! You beat that easy then. Right, there's your dinner. Fireproof trousers, boots. Tim is finishing off books with the kids. They've been bathed and um, it's 10 to 7, kind of a chilled evening. I've decided I'm so tired. I'm not even gonna do my ironing tonight. I'm just gonna I'm gonna be in bed by like half eight, nine o'clock tonight. So I just feel drained, and my body just aches. <laughs> well, I don't do any exercise, but you know when you're just like walking up hills for like you know quite a few hours, it's just tiring. Chasing after the kids, pushing a heavy push chair with a three year old in it. God, although she did walk actually in the end quite a bit. Yeah, so nice early night for all of us because Graham is shattered as well. I hope you've enjoyed this daily or day in the life today. I hope it wasn't too boring. Um, and yeah, thanks so much for watching and I will see you all soon.